Hello everyone, and welcome to some more horrific news. Okay, this seems a bit out of the blue, but it looks like we're getting another Terrifier movie, and the last one isn't even out yet, so let's have a look at it. Terrifier 4, it's officially happening, so strap in for more Art the Clown. Terrifier 3 might not even be out yet, but a forequel has already been confirmed. The Bloody Slasher series follows the misadventures of Art the Clown, as he hacks his way through countless victims with some gruesomely inventive kills. Yes, there will be a Terrifier 4, writer-director Damien Leone said during a Fantastic Fest Q&A. Without elaborating further, Terrifier 3 sees the return of David Howard Thornton as Art the Clown, with Laura Levera back as Sierra, Elliot Fulham returning as Sienna's younger brother, Samantha Scafidi back as Victoria, and Chris Jericho returning as Burke. Newcomers include Daniel Roebuck and Jason Patrick. The movie is set during Christmas time, though it looks like art might be ruining the season of goodwill. The threequel already has a creepy popcorn bucket, too, featuring Art the Clown with blood in his mouth. How that got there, you dread to think. They wanted to reboot it for a wider audience. That's not what I was interested in. They would say, it's gotta be R-rated, it can't be as gory as you made it. They only recently told our sister publication Total Film. I knew they'd never let me shoot the first 10 minutes of what I wanted to do, he added. So I thought, let's just stay true to what the franchise is. Terrifier 3 is set to be the most brutal yet, with Leone sharing on Instagram after the movie wrapped. If you thought Terrifier 2 was insane, we've reached a whole new level of horror madness, it'll almost certainly blow you away. Get ready for the continuation of the Mega Slasher. Terrifier 3 arrives in theatres this October 11th. You can check out our list of the best horror movies to fill out your watch list, or keep up to date with upcoming horror movies heading your way in 2024. And that is it. We've talked quite a bit, obviously, about Terrifier. Uh, Terrifier 2 has its issues, but there's still good parts. You know, it's still true. The fact that he's not buckling the pressure from the studios is a good thing. I'll give him credit for that. Like, it'd be so easy for him just to go, yeah, I'll take the money and go. But he has a particular vision and he wants this to happen. I just hope we're not getting another two and a half hour snore fest or just dragging it out. Because Terrifier 2 started off brilliantly. It was getting there and it just went on and on and on and on. Like I said, check out our reviews. We have discussed the whole art journey, if that makes sense, from the ninth circle onwards. And reviewed the movie separately, so there's plenty of Terrifier stuff in the channel. Plus any updates we're getting like this. I don't know why they're not releasing it in December. I just think it'd be funny to stick it in as a Christmas movie, right amongst it all. But I think maybe the studios are like, no, you're not going to do that. No, no, no. Stay in your box. <laughs> anyway, are you looking forward to this? Let me know what you think. And until next time, keep up to date with the channel. Do the type of things. And remember to keep it creepy, keep it horrific.